Hi everybody, welcome to September. I hope everyone is doing good. I just sort of figured I would make a video to sort of go over like my pin plans for the month. It's a really rainy day here uh, and it's really amplifying that highway. Um, <laughs> so uh, I do not have really time to do a traditional 30 inks, 30 days. Um, so I figured I would do a little bit of the opposite. I would sort of try and go as minimalist as possible. And I'm going to try and do just one pen for the entire month. One pen, I don't know if I'm going to re-ink it, uh, but that pen is going to be uh, this is a Pilot Custom 823, uh, and I'm not going to lie, uh, part of the reason why I thought that I might, uh, I might do one pen for the whole month is because I'm not 100% certain that I can write this thing dry. Uh, it is, uh, a fine nib. I'm just gonna go ahead and write straight up here on this little piece of watercolor paper. It is a fine nib, and I have Sailor Texas in it. Um, so I feel like this is, you know, if I'm going to try something like this, this is the pen to do it with. So uh, that is what, however, I, I, I say that I'm instantly going to break uh, my one pin thing because uh, I am doing a lot of um, walking these days, trying to go around places, and I like to sort of like bring a journal with me, uh, and I'm not taking this pen outside. So uh, when I go outside, and when I want to journal outside, I'm going to bring this, which is uh, a Kaweco Brass Sport, uh, which, uh, doubles as a protective device because you can throw this at someone's face uh, and then you probably get arrested so yeah this also has a fine nib guess I can zoom in huh this is Waco Brass Sport, also with a fine nib because I take a, my journal I take is just a small pocket notebook, so I don't want a big broad uh, nib for it. And the ink in here is Diamine Ancient Copper because it's a brass pen, brass. You know, brass pin, bronze clip, coppery. Uh, the sample of this actually was given to me by pen friend Manda. Thank you, Manda. Uh, I finally got around to using it, and I really, really like it. And I think these two colors just sort of... I'm really, really, really ready for fall, guys. It has been so hot in Florida. So hot. But... This pen I will only be using uh, when I go outside and I'm doing some outside journaling uh, because it can fall and it won't break. For everything else, it's this pen. Um, and it has ooh, just about the best nib I've ever used on a pen. It's beautiful. However, I was thinking about doing some form of 30 inks uh, and I I'm too busy this month to do a video every day and I'm probably too busy to do like fill up a pen and <clears throat> do some writing like a writing sample with it and um, and then clean out the pen 
I was, I'm probably too busy to do that. And I wrote all my pens dry last month, but I don't have 30 pens. And even though I wrote them dry, I didn't clean them out yet. So I don't really have, don't really want to do all that. So what I am going to do instead is I am going to do 30 inks, 30 days, uh, but I'm going to just do essentially 30 swatches, 30 days. So for my birthday in June, my partner made me this, which is uh, basically like a coloring card, um, but they are all sort of like what she sort of used like waterproof ink uh, and drew a bunch of different uh, slimes. I don't know if anyone has ever wa uh, played any of the Dragon Quest or Dragon Warrior games, uh, but they're like little Japanese games uh, with these slime monsters, uh, and they're adorable and very unnerving, uh, but I love them. And so I have 30 of these, and I'm going to go ahead and swatch a different ink uh, every day I'm going to go ahead and post that picture up on my Instagram because I did make an Instagram last April for for 30 inks that month and yeah I think at the end of the month or if I have time like halfway through the month I will make a video sort of going over the, the little slime swatches that I have do a little flip through and uh, and then at the end of the month I'll make another video and then I'll pick out a couple of my favorites and then in October uh, those are going to be I'll pick three or four or five something like that maybe six and those will be my inks that I ink up when I have time, hopefully in October. Uh, in terms of what the inks I'm going to use, uh, I have still just so many samples that were sent to me from various pen friends. Uh, and I'm just gonna pull them out at random. And the only thing is they're going to have, uh, if, I, if I have, because I have used some of those samples. If they are a sample I have used, I am going to just basically pick out one I haven't used. So that is going to be my plan. I don't know. Uh, I really, really look forward to watching everyone else's videos for September 30 Inks. Uh, if you are doing anything for 30 Inks, either on YouTube or Instagram, please let me know, Send put, put a comment, because uh, while I don't have time to record the videos or do something like that, I really, really look forward to watching everyone's uh, 30 Inks videos. So, uh, that is it for me for now. I am probably going to make a video on September, as close as September 9th as possible because they just announced a new Diamond 580 in like navy blue, and that's super exciting. Uh, I'm going to be getting one of those for sure. And <laughs> watch me, watch me get it, and then I'm just gonna break my one pen slash two pen September thing. Anyways, that is it for me for now. I hope you are doing, I hope you are all doing well. I sort of kirked that sentence up a bit. Anyways, hope you're all doing well. See you next time.